Error 5016 is the type of error that you can get in all sorts of different places in Metasoft. Here's an example of one that you might come across. Uh, this is affecting the facility section in the program. Uh, but you could also see this in claim management, when you're trying to run a report, uh, when you're trying to open up your statements. It, it varies. You, know, you could find it in many different places in the program. There's a simple fix to this uh, that could correct it. I say could because uh, there could be more data related issues if, if the fix doesn't take care of it, uh, but we can also help out with that. So it's very simple. The first thing that you want to do to fix this error is to make sure that all the other users are logged out of the program if you're using a network version. And then the second thing is to make a backup of your database. And then finally, the third step is running file maintenance. This is how you do it. So in Metasoft, you're going to go to File, and then go down to File Maintenance. And then once this window pops up, you're only going to worry about these two tabs, Rebuild Indexes and Pack Data. All you have to do is just check the box at the bottom that says All Files under Rebuild Indexes, and then do the exact same thing over in Pack Data. Click on All Files and then click on the Start button. It'll ask you, do you want to continue? Say yes, okay. It's going to go through all the tables in the program, making sure that it's covering the areas that you may have not even come across where that 5016 error might be coming up. So it's going to do this part, and then the next step is pack data. It's going to compress your files, and hopefully might even help uh, boost your performance a little bit in the program. It depends on how large your database is for how long this could take. It could take five minutes, 10 minutes. Uh, we typically don't see it last longer than 15 minutes. But again, it, it all depends on how large your database is. So once you're finished, you'll get this message on the screen that it's been completed. And then go ahead and try it again. See if that cleared out that 5016 error. If it still comes up even after doing this, it's possible that you might have some data corruption. If you do, please reach out to ASCOM Technologies and we'd be happy to help out further. Hey, thanks for watching our video. If you want more videos like this, be sure to subscribe and also do us a favor and click that like button. Thanks again and see you on the next one.